So we can tap on a cell. And then if you want more than one, tap and drag on the lower right. And then once you have the cells selected, in the upper right, we're gonna click on the three dots, tap data validation, and then under criteria, change from list of items to date is valid. And then we can click save. And so at this point, we will have that date picker. And so if I double click in a cell, that date picker is right there on the lower right. And then you can just click okay if you want today's date, or you can pick the date that you want, and you can scroll through the months or pick even just like this. So once you have that date selected, you can click OK, and it'll populate in that cell. To remove the data validation, again, select the cell or cells that you want to remove it in. Again, click that upper right, data validation, and then remove rule. And so I can undo, we want that to be back. And then I can come down here and add a new date. And then if I want to change the date format, I'm going to tap on A to select the entire column. And then I'm going to tap on the top middle where the A and the three lines. And that brings up the formatting at the bottom. And I'm going to scroll down until I see this one, two, three on the right and it's more formats. So if I tap into there, I can scroll down. And here's some standard dates. But if I keep going down, you can see we have more date and time. And now we have a bunch more to pick from. So if I want this spelled out for the month, I can tap that and you can see it applied above just like that.